Did I abuse her or show her disdain? Why does she run from me? If I should... Oh, a popular fairy tale musical about some of your childhood storybook characters. It's making a stop in L.A. Into the Woods is now at the Amundsen Theater in downtown L.A. Tony Award winner Gavin Creel plays the wolf in Cinderella's Prince. He joins us today. This is so exciting to have you and really the cast here in L.A. because this is really Broadway in L.A. It, it really is. I, I'm, I'm so grateful to be here Absolutely. to start. I just, I, I'm, I'm excited that you said that because our entire cast that's at the Amundsen eight times a week just for the next four weeks. Yes has been on a 10 city limited engagement tour across the country and we are so happy to be finishing here in LA. And the audiences so far have been, I think, honestly, our best that we've had. They just yeah. keep getting better and better and LA is not disappointing. Yeah, a great way to end it. But I mean, it's yeah. so rare that you would have so many Broadway actors on stage here. Yeah, yeah, we were just talking. It's, it's, it's very, um, I was told even the 30s they used to do it, but then mm -hmm. you have, uh, a lot of New York actors are, it's hard to leave your homes, it's yeah. hard to leave your families, your pets, yeah. your loved ones, your friends. Almost every single person from our closing Broadway cast mm -hmm. is in this production. So we just, including uh, Stephanie J. Block and Sebastian Arcelis, who play our two leads, the baker and the baker's wife, they have their eight-year-old daughter and their mm -hmm. nanny. They are, they've moved their life across the country wow. and they're, they've come home because they're from Sacramento. Oh, so, nice, yeah. nice. Now, I understand you reprised your role. I did. Tell, tell us a little bit about that. Well, I'm, I'm uh, this entire production started as a 10-day rehearsal, 10-day concert at the City Center Encore Series in New York. And we had no idea we would be going on to Broadway. And we transferred uh, from that two weeks at City Center to do two months on Broadway just for the summer. And it was such a hit that it extended for six months total. And then while we were there, they said, we want to take this on the road. We want to share this story with audiences across the country. And it's been sold out. It's been, I mean, it's like a rock concert. And we're, yeah. I'm playing a wolf <laughs> and a prince. And you would yes. think I was, you know, Justin Timberlake. <laughs> it's crazy that the, the mm. energy is really beautiful. Yeah, yeah. And I was reading, I didn't realize that you're also a songwriter. I am, yeah. Yeah, that's very exciting. Yeah. I didn't know a little tidbit there that I hadn't heard before. Thank you. Yeah, I, I've actually written a show called Walk On Through that we're going to debut at the um, MCC Theater in New York. Yeah. And uh, it's about my exploration. It's sort of like about a midlife crisis mm -hmm. in the Metropolitan Museum of Art and how the art works on me and what I found in this visit to the museum. And thank you for saying that. Yeah. I'm, so, I'm so grateful for you bringing that up. Yeah, I'm glad to get a little, you know, taste yep. of what's I'm to come. A, I'm going to premiere it in the fall and I hope we have a lot of wonderful audiences for that yeah. as well. Well, I hope you come back and talk to us about it again. I definitely Appreciate will. It. All right, well, thank you so much. Thank you. And you can find more information about Into the Woods and how to get tickets by going to kcalnews.com and clicking Scene on TV.